Whether to inspire the youth, open eyes, or to simply share fun tidbits, science needs communication. Welcome to SciPK, I'm PK, and today we'll be talking about the importance of science communication. For clarity's sake, I will be referring to science communication defined as the act of sharing information on the world of science and engineering. If you were a child in the 90s, 2000s, or even the early 2010s, you may remember the famous tune, Bill Nye the Science Guy entertaining, informative, fun, or perhaps even funny. How many people do you think were inspired to study science or engineering because of this man's brilliant science show for kids? How many of those kids do you think grew up to actually become scientists or engineers? I'm willing to bet it's a considerable number. Then there's content for adults. Let's start with Veritasium, the guy who literally has a doctorate in science communication. Veritasium tells us about some of the most complex physical or mathematical problems or phenomena in the world. And he does it so seamlessly that afterwards you can't help yourself but to look it up on the internet. That is, you scour the internet enough until you find this guy, Mark Rober. Sure, he catches bad guys, but he also does cool experiments and makes fun doodads. Oh, and he also used to work at NASA on the Curiosity rover. Sure, NASA is cool, but what about an electrical engineer who periodically hurts himself to display electrical concepts? Electro Boom. His name fits him. He hurts him a lot and he causes a lot of booms. However, we all know it's scripted to make it look like an accident, and that's because he's trying to make you retain more information by making it more entertaining. So you see my point. There's a lot of them to talk about, so I won't mention them all, but they all have something in common. They love what they're doing and they want you to love it as much as they do. Why do we need them? Because it sure would be an awesome world if everyone loved science and engineering as much as these people do and viewed the world through the eyes of curiosity. And no, not the rover. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe and check out my other videos as it helps out a lot. My socials are in the description. And as always, stay curious.